Women's Skeleton World Cup Finals in the BMW IBSF Tour in Calgary in Canada. Bronze medalist four years ago, the last time there was a World Cup race on this track and her first World Cup medal, Laura Dees, was in sixth position after the first heat, but a smoking second run would see her take a comfortable lead from Jane Channel of Canada. Sixth after the first of the two heats, the World Cup points leader, Elena Nikitina. Now she only needed a 14th position finish to guarantee herself the Crystal Globe as the series title winner. And she had a good run going, but it drifted away at the bottom of the track. She dropped behind Laura Dees with five sleds still to go. The Russians still led when Tina Herman came to the line, runner-up in the last two World Cup seasons, second in the points coming into the final race of the year. She'd been on the podium the night before and she took a handy lead over Laura Dees with Nikitina now in third and still three to go. After Russia's Yulia Kanakina had dropped out of medal contention, there were just two sliders left, both Canadian, both medalists the night before. Second after the first heat, Mimi Raniva. She'd won on Friday night the makeup race for the missing encounter in Koenigsee, but she dropped behind the flying German into second spot. She still had a chance of a medal. The final slider, Elizabeth Meyer. Four years ago, the World Cup here was her second ever World Cup race and she won it. She was in the bronze medal position the previous night. Could she win again? Well, she dropped behind before the line, out of the medals. Tina Herman claiming the final win of the World Cup season from Mimi Raniva and Laura Dees back on the podium. And Tina, second in the World Cup rankings, but the World Cup champion for the first time ever in women's skeleton is a Russian, Elena Nikitina, as she claimed the Crystal Globe at season's end.